What's up? Husky Media here, bringing a brand new tutorial. Well, I can't say it's a new tutorial, because this is just going to be a remake of my first video, which has had a lot of views, which I'm pretty proud of, and thank you for, for the views. Uh, this this um, remake is going to be on my first video on how to burn like PS2 games on the DVD, and this is what we're going to do. But my first video didn't have I didn't have a DVD. Now I have a DVD, and this is what we're gonna be using. So, first thing you're gonna need to have is a program called Image Burn. Image Burn is a DVD burning software where you can use ISOs. You know, let's just go into program. Image Burn. Image Burn, the ultimate image burner. Please wait. It comes up. A little quote. Hey Sam. I mean Max. Don't get that. Well, you can do a different, like, a, there's a bunch of options you can use. Actually, there's only six. <laughs> you can write an image file to a disk. You can create an image file from a disk. You can verify a disk. You can write files slash folders to a disk. You can make an image file from uh, files or folders in your computer. Or, I don't know, that means discovery. I feel like it means something about, like, 0001110011, stuff like that. So... We're gonna use write image file to disk. See, I have a DVD already. See, that's when we can burn something. My, like I said in my first video, I use a Sony DVD minus R 16x, uh, 120 minutes of recording, of recording minutes, and like when you do get it, see the maximum is 16. Put it at 8x. I highly recommend the Sony because they work for like basically all games. I haven't had a single problem. I think I already have like 11 PS2 games I used for Swap Magic. Uh, yes. So, you, I put it on 8x. That's pretty good enough for me. I like that. Everything's fine. So, when, after you put your DVD in, and lets everything like boot up, where it, where it says, please select a file, you gotta click this. Right here. Where it says, browse for a file. Click that. This is my whole list of PS2 games plus a little like a couple PS1 games still that's not important this is not in the video the ones where you see a little thunder in the circle that's my PS2 games so I don't know what the games we should get uh probably the Simpsons hit and run probably Spider-Man I don't know Spider-Man I, I feel like I want Spider-Man oh god ah. ultimate Spider-Man I already got that uh Oh man, I should have decided this before I even started the video. Go. Quick pause. We're back. Ah, uh, sorry. My mom was looking for my sister. But back to what we're doing. Eh, I don't know. Eesh. Hang on, everyone. So yes, I think we're just going to use. I'm just gonna go for the hit, the hit and run. Yeah, I'm just going for hit and run. Yeah, hit and run. Let's just go for that. So now, after you click the Simpsons hit and the like the game you want, it should be there. You should see all the information up here. Make sure you click verify. Always make sure you click verify so it makes sure that the game's perfect for the disc. Or it's not like when it's burning, you're gonna see a little misread, miss errors, and stuff like that. So yes. So uh, since all my information's here, all my like my DVD information, my write speed, remember 8x, 16 divided by 2. So after that, if you feel like this, like the game you chose is the game you absolutely want, and you feel like it, I feel like I, I want this game. It's not a pretty bad game. You know what? Hang on. Before I, before you even burn the game, oh, I think, let me just minimize this tab right here. I think it's a good idea to get a program called PCSX2. It's a PS2 emulator. It's pretty good, so you can, before you play your game, you can actually see if it works. So we're going to, see, I, I almost forgot about that. We're going to see if this thing actually works. So, where is it? The Simpsons Hit and Run. If we see it, it, since my computer is not, like, the best computer, 
ever, we're just gonna see if it appears. If it like appears, that's when we're good. Let's just wait. Okay. See this? <coughs> uh, sorry, I have a little cold. Uh, I know this was a bad idea. Oh no. Yeah, let's continue. Hmm. This is loading still. Yeah, I since it's a computer, since it's an emulator, it might be going slow, but when you burn it on a DVD, or if you use SWAT magic, it runs at full speed. You don't have to worry about, like, oh no, my emulator runs slow. That's me. It's gonna run, run slow on my PS2. You don't have to worry about that, anyone. You're safe. Okay, I'm thinking, I'm thinking it's gonna be, we're gonna be okay. So. So far, it looks like it's going good. <coughs> Sorry. Just skip that. Okay, that works. something to do with Homer. Come on. Since I'm using Bandicam, I'm using the unregistered version. I only get 10 minutes to make videos. So, we gotta hurry this up. Come on. If you can see, we, only, we got like 7 minutes going on here. Ah, ah, yeah, ah. yeah. Yeah. So this is back up. Let's just reselect the game again so nothing we make sure that nothing happened while we did while we're doing our little fun here. The hit and run, open, and then make sure 8x, verify, and then after that, see this button right here? It says it's ready. Click it. Boom. Make sure you click eject tray, and if you didn't click verify, you can just click verify right here. When you click eject tray, that's mean when it's done burning, it's going to eject the tray. And we are going. I'm gonna. We're gonna do a little quick pause here until the game actually finished burning. Okay, everyone. Uh, just quick pause and see you after the game is done burning. Bye bye. You can see now. Now we just it's finished burning it. Now it's starting to verify it. We'll be back when it's actually finished burning. Quick pause. We're back. And it seems like the Simps the Simpsons hit and run has finished burning. So yes, operation successfully completed. That's me, as it says right there, there's zero miscompares, zero read errors. So yes. Quick pause. Sorry for that quick pause, everyone. So yes, that has just been the video on how to burn PS2 games to a DVD minus R. This is Husky Media signing out. Peace!